Hey everyone, I'm John Dowd. I'm 46 years old and I'm from Ludlow, Mass. Back when I first started racing, way back when uh, 85, I think it was, uh, my first race here at Southwood, I actually knocked myself right out. I forgot to slow down over one of those humps, and uh, they say the sand is soft, but it, uh, it's not that soft. It can get you. So I've uh, been through uh, quite a few teams. Uh, you know, I got with uh, a team, team boys in Yamaha, privateer team in the, in the beginning. Um, team Yamaha, then Team Kawasaki. I rode for KTM for three years. Uh, and now I ride for Chaplin Kawasaki um, as a privateer and uh, pretty much retired. So um, I've had a lot, a lot of laps around this track here at South Lake. I've had some good ones, some bad ones, some dry ones, some wet ones, hot ones, cold ones. But uh, I'll tell you what, South Lake is South Lake. It's, it's tough no matter what the conditions. It's going to be a tough race no matter what the, what the time of the year. Yeah, you know, a lot of people ask me how I, uh, you know, how I can keep going at my age and I, I don't know if I really have a, a specific answer. I mean, you know, I really enjoy the sport. Obviously, I, I love racing, I love riding. You know, I, I still have as much fun riding uh, as I did in the beginning. Um, I just don't have quite the desire to go racing every weekend nowadays, but uh, I just love the sport. You know, it's, it's a great time. You meet a lot of new friends all around the country. For me, the biggest thing with the longevity is just, uh, you know, keeping yourself in as good a shape as you can and uh, try to be ready for the races as much as you can. Um, I notice now that I'm older, if I don't pre prepare myself a little bit, it's tough. I mean, I, I get sore and uh, I feel 46 after these races, I'll tell you. I went to a few other races this year. I went to Millville. I've always loved Millville. That was my, uh, my first legitimate win uh, at, at a national race. So, um, you know, I got the opportunity to go there with, you know, my, some of my sponsors, Kenny G's Performance Tuning and Chapman Cowie. And, uh, they, they got a good amateur uh, day program too, so I wanted to bring my son out there um, and let him kind of get his feet wet. Um, and also I figured, what the heck, I'm going out there, I might as well uh, ride myself. So um, it was really just trying to get myself going a little bit because I haven't, you know, I haven't raced a whole lot this year, local races and stuff, so uh, I figured, why not go out there and uh, try riding and see if I can make it in the program and uh, see if I can make it through the 30 minutes, the 35 or whatever minutes. It's, it's pretty tough these days, so um, I thought it would help me maybe get through Southwick if I did one or two other races before this this year. Well, you know, it's that's that's definitely part of it. I mean, you know, they raised the point thing this year, so it's 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 kind of a bummer. I mean, I need 25 points this year instead of uh, just one like it used to be. But uh, you know, obviously, I would love to try to keep it. Um, hopefully, I can have something happen here today at Southwick, but. Uh, you know what, if it doesn't, it doesn't. I mean, uh, I know I can't keep it forever, so it is what it is. I mean, I, I'm going to give it my best shot here, and uh, let's see what happens. I have a lot of fun, uh, you know, taking my son Ryan racing, and then uh, it's, it's actually been really good for me, too. I mean, I, I, I do love the sport. I've always, you know, obviously that's why I'm still here, and uh, I really enjoy watching him, you know, progress and learn things, and. Uh, you know, I would be going, even uh, even if I wasn't racing at all, I'd be going for him probably at this point. So, um, but I, you know, I really that's a big part of the reason why uh, I think I can still get out here and compete somewhat with these guys is because he wants to go riding every every week, couple of days a week, and, and race every weekend. So, whether I want to or not, I'm kind of I'm kind of stuck in there doing it. So, uh, but it's fun. I mean, I do enjoy it. Like I said, I I don't really play golf or you know basketball or anything else so uh, I guess this is this is what I'm doing I don't know what the future holds for me as far as how long I can keep doing this it's uh, I mean that's been a question for 10 years I, I think everyone always asked me if I can come out another year and and honestly I never thought I would still be doing it at, at this age uh, so I mean I don't know I, I always uh, I kind of say if I I just figure if, I, if I'm still riding and somewhat competitive, then I'll probably come out and try to give it a whirl. Um, at some point though, I, I'm sure the reality uh, of just maybe being too old and not wanting to go that fast, uh, that'll set in, but uh, 
for now, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep pushing at it and and see what I can make of it.